welcome back to the channel holy crap we hit 100k subscribers real quick i just want to say thank you to everybody who has been following my channel you guys are absolutely amazing now jumping right into the video it is an absolutely insane one cowboy a tsm professional fortnite player has officially been released from the roster it honestly seems to be a pretty blurry situation tsm cowboy has deleted his twitter and deleted his discord but he did come out on twitch and give a response and it seems like he is actually denying all accusations. As I said, guys, it's a crazy and a messy situation. I'm going to be giving you guys all the information that has come out publicly. I will keep a lot of the information private due to the wishes of people involved in the situation. So basically, I'm just going to explain everything that has happened up until this point, and you guys can come to your own conclusion. So this was tweeted out by Slasher, who is a known Overwatch League leaker. He has a lot of inside information, and he has been accurate pretty much with everything he has ever tweeted out. He said this, according to Twitch streamer Faith, TSM Pro Fortnite player Cowboy, whom is married, sent inappropriate messages to an underage female streamer. Speaking to the streamer, who wants to remain anonymous, she was made uncomfortable. Cowboy has since deleted his Twitter and Discord. And then here is the clip of Faith, who was the one who initially exposed him for this situation. Let's roll it. Imagine messaging a 16-year-old girl when you're married and saying... Looking good. Winky face. Imagine you're in TSM and you message an underage girl saying looking good at winky face. Imagine, 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 imagine you do that. Imagine. What do you say? Imagine you say to the girl, your, your actual Discord name, Cowboy1069. So that's what she said on her stream. Now, I will point out that this was like a 3 a.m. stream when she was getting drunk. Now, I don't think that changes the story that much. It just shows that she was a little over emotional during the stream and was very angry at Cowboy. Now, TSM did officially release Cowboy. They tweeted this out. Yesterday, Cowboy was officially released and is no longer affiliated with us. That's it. And then Cowboy did make a response to this. Slasher tweeted this out. Cowboy has made a statement in his offline Twitch chat. Hey guys, don't believe everything you read on the internet. I am not married and I have hired a lawyer to clear my name. I am not allowed to talk about anything, but I am not a pedophile. So he's pretty much denying everything, saying that he is lawyering up, so anybody involved in this situation should definitely be careful. Now something I will say is that I did reach out to some people who were close with Cowboy, and they did tell me that he was not married. He actually only had a girlfriend. Which however you look at it, it could be good, it could be bad, but that is what I have heard. He is not married, he only had a girlfriend. Now I will not lie to you guys, I have seen the screenshots of everything that happened, and due to people who are involved in the situation, I do not want to share them and I do not really want to give my opinion on them because again this is a very sticky situation and it could get extreme when it comes to legal action. Of course TSM dropping Cowboy does make it seem like he probably did do these things but then again, a big organization like TSM probably just doesn't want to be involved in a situation like this, whether or not it is as extreme as it seems to be. So it's basically a waiting game now. We're going to sit here and we have to see what Cowboy comes out with next with his lawyer. And we're going to have to wait and see if one of the people involved in this situation does want to come out and post things publicly so everybody can see what actually went down. But again, as I said, it's a waiting game and we're going to have to sit here and wait to see what happens. Hopefully one day the full truth does come out because in my opinion, that's what matters to me. Me. And that's pretty much it for this video guys. Thank you so much for watching If you did enjoy getting updated on this situation and you didn't really know what happened up until this point Be sure to like the video and share it around so everybody else knows what happened as well Also, if you want to stay updated on all pro news and Fortnite drama Be sure to subscribe to my channel for more daily videos. Oh and real quick I gotta say thank you once again for the hundred thousand subscribers guys That's absolutely nuts if you're happy about it And you're glad you're supporting me and you made it this far into the video Be sure to type hashtag 100k down below in the comments. I will be harding and trying to reply to everybody that does it. Now that's gonna be it. Thank you so much, guys. I love you all. Peace.